Hello ladies and gentlemen, no name here, and here is another multiplayer video of my online battle. Okay, uh, in this match I lost. <laughs> to be to be uh, true with you, I I'm gonna say it immediately. I lost this match, so I'm gonna go and explain myself what I do, why I did it, and so you can tell me on comments or you know by posting on the forums uh, what do you think about my moves where did I make wrong what I did wrong what should I improve where was I wrong and that kind of stuff so be free to comment and uh, give me some advices and um, you can say oh yeah you did this good but this was bad decision so of, uh, at the end you just suck it okay let's first pause it a bit just to introduce my army okay I had three squads of Bokachi two squads of uh, Red Bear Infantry and one squad of Bokachi oh no yeah three squads of Bokachi uh, two squads of Red Bear Infantry and my general is a gunner so he can shoot and of course I had one of the wooden cannons well I had some free space and free funds for some uh, additional uh, units so I said okay let's buy these guys maybe they can be useful anyway I'm just going to you know waste my money so let's have it let's see what my enemy uh, gens had had okay he had a spare levy he had General Hatamoto, who is, uh, I think he is Mili, as much as I recall. Yeah, he's Mili, Katana guy. Yeah, he's very dangerous in close combat. Spear Levy, uh, Red Bear Infantry, Red Bear Infantry, uh, and Red Bear Infantry, and another Red Bear Infantry. And there is a Matchlock Kachi. Uh, okay, and that's it so let's begin our battle okay let's go okay my main goal was to get through here to workshop and uh, to and I assumed that uh, we will both meet somewhere here maybe so then I said okay let's capture this hill as as soon as possible or somewhere here on, on, on a lower ground so when he gets here he will face me in a uh, open field and I will be in a line and ready so my archers will be somewhere here shooting his units while he perform his lines and develop and deploy his units so I will be in advantage immediately my cannons did not shoot I was really really upset about it and I didn't know what to do I went okay guys can you move no I didn't know they cannot move they're just sitting there and they can only shoot what they can they can shoot and that's it so they were almost useless okay my enemy gens is moving across the river just as I do and my cavalry I moved my cavalry to the woods hoping that my enemy won't see it so I will run in here and here and so on and so on when I need it I will just jump in and uh, help my other units so here we go my units are moving I'm holding the line hoping that I will put my archers here and hopefully shoot his units while he develops and my guys my uh, red bear infantry and my other ones where is it where are they where are they red bear infantry and and and, and where is my another <laughs> Where are you, little B? Red Bear Infantry, Red Bear Infantry, and where is another unit? I know I had it. Damn it. Okay. Doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, my Red Bear Infantry should hold the line somewhere here, facing the enemy. That was my goal. Well, I did not. I must admit, I did not saw this matchlocks moving here I was totally concentrating here my first mistake not looking at entire battlefield very bad very bad so my cavalry moved here to this uh, forest so I can protect my uh, archers 
And then I said to myself, oh, he's moving over there. Okay, let's move my general and shoot these spear levy. So I will just have some, you know, advantage. They will ch try to chase me or something. And I will just shoot them, escape and shoot, escape and shoot, and that kind of stuff. And I did not realize that my, <laughs> that my bowmen cannot reach the enemy. So what I did next was trying to move my archers here and shoot. In the meantime, my general just rushed in and tried to shoot, but he did not wait for me. He just moved his Pillavi back. And here was my first mistake, as I can say. Holding too much around here and shooting the enemy, because Red Bear Infantry already phased me and I took too much time and they just shoot one platoon on me. And my general was in deep trouble right here. I had many losses of his bodyguards right here. And he was already, oh, ha, 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 okay, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta escape and that kind of stuff. Okay, what I did next? Okay, my infantry, my uh, bowmen's, okay, were ready and I ordered them shoot with the flame arrows to the enemy. My red bear infantry was very nice developed, deployed, sorry. I captured the workshop, that's good, and but I didn't have any melee units. That's problem, that's very problem, but okay. Then I then I again realized that my bowman do, do does not do not have a uh, reach range to capture his any units. So I had to move them more forward through here, and that's exactly what I did. In the meantime, I moved my cavalry to this forest here, which will later prove like a bad move. Okay, and here I am. Placed all my guys. Okay. Holding the line, facing the enemy, ready to shoot them when they cross this little choking point. And my bowman. Okay. Shoot. Little more forward. And. And. Shoot, boys, shoot. Here we go. And I was hoping I was doing very nice move here. I think I I were I was doing very nice move here. I was behind these uh, houses, and I was ritually uh, protected against against his uh, infantry. And my bowmen were very very nicely nicely covered, very nicely covered, and very good uh, at shooting. Okay, my cavalry were was still here, not moving anywhere. Still in the forest. And here we go. I think this was very bad development here. Deployment, sorry, of my units. And where was my mistake at first? Okay, I knew that this is gonna happen, but I did not know why my red red bear infantry did not shoot first. I did not. Uh, I did not know that. I don't know that yet. If you know, please tell me. I don't know why they can shoot them, but my guys can shoot these. Let's see. Uh, range, range 125, ranged 125. I really don't know why are is he shooting me and I can't shoot him. But my bowman can do, and here is my mistake with cavalry. I did not saw this, and I had to move my cavalry back, back. But it was already in in a in a routing, already in problems, so I could not do anything about it. And here were my problems. My archer, my bowmen's were those who will do the most of the damage. Here I am finally reaching my range of my own spear level. We're in deep trouble here, but they will reach my Red Bear Infantry, and that's where my Red Bear Infantry were in the problems and useless, literally useless, and sitting ducks for this Red Bear Infantry of Gens. Okay, let's see here. Uh, 
my cavalry is uh, completely rooting, destroyed and here I am trying to shoot with bowmen this left this remnants of spear, spear levy and with my red bear infantry trying to re, 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 re regroup, reposition and shoot back this red bear infantry and in the meantime I had problems with uh, spear levy and uh, trying to <laughs> you know trying to get get a stronger hand over here my general is doing a very nice job shooting red bear infantry trying to uh, contribute to the fight his general is coming into attack which was not good at all because he's melee guy and he can run through my infantry and my bowmen and here I am I was hoping that I will I will I will get upper hand here but no I can't because my bowmen were not enough support for my red bear infantry against his two squads two units of red bear infantry yeah my unit is running away here I have a problem with my with my wooden cannons which were completely useless and and here we go my general is doing nice job but that's not not even even close enough here I had another another hope that well that I will do something about it but this spear, spear levy were doing very good job uh, keeping my Bokachi uh, busy now I had to move my general back and try to do my whole strategy move back shoot, move back shoot, move back shoot okay my bowmen still were on the battlefield and shooting but his general is coming to cut them just clean my general is gonna finally get upper hand here and completely destroy this spear levy which he did and now I placed everything against this red bear infantry I even hoped I will win but I could not uh, put my general in danger so I will have to shoot with my bows, bows hoping that why that my bow catch will gonna reach his uh, his red bear infantry so I'll keep them in close combat but nope my bow catchy were running away which was not good at all these spear levy were here not doing anything I don't know why maybe some kind of bug or something I don't know and here it is I could not do anything his red bear infantry were holding the line and now they're gonna completely decimate my bow catch my general rooting all my units rooting that's it yeah they're routing yeah and that's it okay I know I made some big mistakes around here placing my cavalry my cavalry was completely useless did not do anything uh, if you have any comments advices anything if you if you think I should do something else better and anything else different just comment place your comments your your thoughts and everything and thank you for watching thanks for uh, your support and no name I'm no named out and see you in another video bye bye uh, here is no named again well uh, as you can see from this uh, statistics uh, you can see I deployed much much less than gens did I lost much much less uh, not much but less than he did and I killed more than he did but I still lose uh, deployment I don't understand this why I deployed less than he did I don't know hmm well anyway uh, I just wanted to show you this and that's it now really <laughs> no name doubt bye